Anthony Ford. I'm stationed in Camp Casey, Korea. I'd like to say hi to my mom, my dad, my grandma and grandpa in Kaufman, Texas. Happy holidays. Love you. Unchecked water is shooting through vacant houses, schools, and other empty structures across Detroit. The product of vandals, scrappers, and Michigan's cold winters, the unused water is creating health and safety risks. In a city plagued with abandoned homes and buildings, there's one thing that runs well in Detroit. Water. Torrents of water. Spewing from broken pipes down drains and into dark basements, creating health and safety risks. It weakens the home's foundation. It, it can serve as a breeding ground for mosquitoes and, and other insects. And it's costly. A gallon of water escapes every five seconds from a vandalized pipe in this vacant house on Chalmers Street. Enough to fill eight Olympic-sized swimming pools in a year. The annual drinking water cost for the house would be about $2,300. The city is left with the tab, but next door, Shirley Young is convinced she's also paying the price. I'm not using that much water, but I get a high water bill. The water department is aware of the rampant problem. We receive between 10 and 20 um, calls or, com or concerns with running water in an abandoned structure on a daily basis. Crews are doing what they can to deal with the overflow. But like so many in Detroit, they're simply trying to keep their heads above water. Mike Householder, Associated Press.